guys it's stacy and today's january 15 2021 i pray everyone is doing well i uh, had this dream awesome dream three days ago and i pray this blesses you all right um this started where i was just flying 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 and i knew that this was it was just so clear it was just so vivid and in fact i knew i was i I was in my I knew I was awake in the stream and in fact I was just as I was flying I was praying that I I am not going anywhere this is I was just proclaiming the name of Jesus I just wanted it to be with Jesus if I was gonna fly it's only going to be with Jesus it was it was as if I knew and I was aware and I was praying not to be misled um, I did not want any other spirit <laughs> to um to bring me anywhere except only in the name of jesus and so i was continuously flying and i noticed as i was just as i was saying the lord's name i just noticed that it's like my soul the my faith was so strong than ever and the stronger it was the higher like the faster i was going as i was flying and as like i kind of as i passed it's like as it's like as if you're flying you're like you're passing different realms of 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 the heavenly um and then i reached that certain point where it's just like i feel like it's like way above and all of a sudden i'm just hugging this person and we were twirling around just hugging and it's as if i did not i had my eyes closed and it's i knew that it was like I was so I, I did not attempt to open my eyes because I kind of knew if I opened my eyes then this dream would end so I just I just kept my eyes closed yet I could see like through me it's just so powerful that I could just see white um and it's just so powerful and I was hugging this person so I just felt so much peace and um just so much love and it just all of a sudden like it just i came to the realization that this is god this is jesus and when i came to that realization guys i found myself like all of a sudden i just knew still my eyes were closed but i was surrounded in this in this water and i just felt the water was just so refreshing and it's like it's like i had my eyes closed but i knew and i could it's like i could see through the water I don't know if that makes it it's i just could see i could just feel it i could see it it's just i just knew i was surrounded by that um by that that by the by the water and it was just so purifying and um just i just felt like my soul was rejuvenated guys and as i was just kind of like enjoying that moment i found myself and this time I just really saw I was going down through the steps and all of a sudden I was with this boy probably a little boy like seven to nine years old and I had my arm around him like he was my I felt like he was my best friend and we were just like uh, we we're just like hanging and we we're just like going down these steps and we we're just like having a great time and i was in fact saying you know what you're my angel and we were just like we we're just smiling we we're just just happy and then i just noticed like i felt like i was a kid all over again like i felt i felt like i was just we were the same um it's like we were the same because i had my arm over him yet he was a little boy and i we were this kind of the same height but at the same time, I just knew mentally, my maturity was there. I was still the same mentally, but in, deep inside, I felt like I was a kid. And then the dream ended and I just had so much, um, I was just smiling when I woke up, just so much peace guys. And so um, Holy Spirit revealed right away what I dreamed. And so, okay, um, what, uh, um, Holy Spirit just showed me that what I dreamed was the Holy Trinity. What does the Holy Trinity mean? It means three. Um, God the Father in three forms, but it's all, all one God. 
Okay, all right, I'm gonna go back. Okay, hold on. Um, hang on with me with this, guys. Okay, all right. God the Father, with my faith, as I was flying up, I was hugging this person. It was just so divine. And this person was God. God the Father, the creator of all things. Then all of a sudden, I find myself in that, um, in that water. What does water represent? The Holy Spirit. And it was just, what does the Holy Spirit do? It, it's the Holy Spirit is the sanctifier. It means, um, um, it makes us. It's the it sanctifies us. It um, brings us brings us to that area where we could become holy to sanctify. Okay. So I saw the God the Father, God the Holy Spirit, and then all of a sudden, I was with this little boy who was my best friend, God the Son, and it's all obvious guys all over scripture you know the word has been made flesh through jesus um god the son incarnation of god as a human being and so i'm so humbled by get this guys because it's as if uh, something so intangible in my dreams becomes i don't know quite it becomes tangible if it makes any sense guys i mean okay um anyways the trinity it's all one god it's one god in but the lord in different forms okay so this is the power of god guys god created all things okay he made you he made us he made everything but because of our wicked flesh because of our sins god had to send his only son through jesus to die in the cross for us and that is the most amazing love story that nothing could beat he died in the cross for us and get this not only that when jesus ascended into heaven he brought he promised us the Holy Spirit, which we have right now, the Holy Spirit as the sanctifier, the Holy Spirit so that we could have that continuous connection with God. Isn't that amazing? How God loves you, how God loves us so much. And it's all displayed in all that power, all that, it's all pure love and the thing is it's not you know i grew up knowing god and knowing <laughs> um holy spirit you know knowing jesus but it's so different guys the holy spirit is urging us not to just know it we have to live it um we have to you know the holy spirit was given us we have the power see this is the thing once we have that faith and it's only through faith that we are saved only that faith and it says in the bible if you have faith as small as a mustard seed you could move mountains just that faith that connects us that bring us to god and god brings unto us the Holy Spirit. You have been sanctified. You have been chosen. But in order for you to witness the Holy Spirit, we have to walk in the Spirit. We have to see in the Spirit. And that's the only way, guys. Now, once we walk in the Spirit, while we are in this world, in this dream, I realized it was shown to me that when you walk in the Holy Spirit, it's as if you, you're also, it's like you're also, we are to build that walk. We have to walk with Jesus. We have to build that relationship. Um, 
it's as if guys like um in this dream i was walking with my best friend we were just happy it's like you know when you have your best friend through thick and thin through mountains and valleys no matter what happens to you you have your best friend at your side and it nothing nothing could bring you down um i believe that this is the type of relationship you know jesus wants with us it's 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 that intimate relationship and we have to dig into that relationship we have to walk in the spirit and continue to have that 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 relationship with god so that we get to know him we get to know um the very heart of jesus and so it says guys i'm gonna end this it's i pray this blesses you in john 15 15 John 15 verse 15 why should we why do you want to walk why should we walk or build that relationship with Jesus in John 15 verse 15 it says that you know Jesus says to the apostles you know you are no longer my servants but because you are my friends he shows he shows all his friends um, the business of the kingdom he once you have that relationship once you have that friendship with jesus he gives you and it's he it's because you, that because of that friendship he trusts you so much with his word but at the same time he reveals to you the business of his kingdom and it just all of a sudden it's you just you just know why you're here your purpose in life and i pray i pray that this blesses you i pray that everyone you know just continue continuously as we wait for the coming of jesus you just continue to build that relationship bring that relationship to to fire fire that fire for jesus um and it's amazing guys because once we have that once we're friends once we have that deep um he's once he's your best friend you just know that he reveals the secrets the spiritual secrets um and i pray for each and every one to experience that um i'm gonna pray lord jesus thank you thank you for being with us and help us to to have that deep relationship with you have that deep intimacy so that we could so that we could walk in your spirit we could walk in power we could walk in your promises and we could witness healings and help us to be just continuously on fire for you lord jesus and as we walk through may you may the holy spirit just pour just the holy spirit just pour onto all of us the secrets of the kingdom more revelations oh lord jesus we put our trust in you with all of our heart and we love you with all of our heart in jesus mighty name amen all right guys um all right just had to share that and i pray you have a wonderful and blessed day ahead um god bless you Bye.